What's up, guys, and welcome to another episode of the DMG Tech Show. I'm your host, Jonathan Parkinson, and what I'm going to do quickly is explain how to add uh, themes to Elementary OS. Now, you are going to need to make sure that you do have uh, the Elementary tweaks installed. So if you're on Luna, it's pretty simple. If you're on Freya, they just updated it about two months ago, give or take, to where there is now support for it. Uh, there are a little bit different in certain aspects, but for the majority of the layout, it's the exact same thing. So what I'm going to go to do is uh, I'll have a link for this in the uh, description. And this is customelementaryos.devinart.com. And from here, you can find certain things like wallpapers, mock-ups, screenshots, icons, and lo and behold, themes. Now, to actually get this installed, it's pretty straightforward. Uh, what I will go ahead and do, let's see if there's one in here, I'll go ahead and install real quick. Uh, one that I maybe enjoy the button features. So what I'll do is, hmm, which one should I do? I guess we'll do this one. Champagne. Sounds interesting. So. Go ahead and click on the theme that you want. And this is obviously just one location where some of these themes are located. Uh, that doesn't necessarily mean that this is the only themes available. So what I did is I go ahead and download it. Now, since it is downloaded, you will know that it's going to be located in your file browser, which is in your download section. You can go ahead and extract that file as well. So I'll go ahead and extract it extract quit I can delete that file now to save space there we go I'm gonna go ahead and cut it now you are going to need to open up a new window or at least the original window could be this as well with root privileges so if you just right click your files you can go into it that way uh, go into your file system you need to go down to user share scroll all the way down until you see the word themes which is a t where are we at themes and that's it and then all you got to do is just paste it oops looks like i cut it looks like that didn't work so i'll go and open up both of them let's go ahead and draw you over here it looks like i can do it that way but i can't necessarily do it the other way so let me see if i can drag and drop it if not we're gonna go Yeah, so there we go, that worked. So I just dragged and dropped that out of here and you can see Numic Champagne is there. I can get rid of the original file, close, close, and to get to it, you're gonna go ahead and go into your system settings and make sure you do, again, have elementary tweaks installed. Go into tweaks and go to GTK. So there's Numic theme champagne and there's the champagne look to it, uh, which I'm not really a fan of. That's eh, not that bad. Uh, but yeah, so as you can see, there's quite a few different ones. I have a few already pre-installed. If you're like into something like a, uh, like that, that's kind of neat, kind of clean looking, uh, kind of matches with the new mix icons that I have down here. Might have to adjust a few things such as like that and a few of these things up in here. But for majority of the people, this should be all you needed to see. Uh, if you do have any questions or comments about anything, as always, leave them down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Uh, again, I'll have the links in the description below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next video.